Grignard reagent is strong nucleophile. So it will attack over maximum positive minimum stirring. So this is the position which have maximum positive and minimum stirring. So this nucleophile will attack over this part, breaks this bond and give this type of molecule. If we add water, acidic hydrogen or OH, alcohol is okay, but if we use alkyl halide, that is if alkyl halide is present in another reaction container and if we draw, if we add this reaction into that container. This is also a nucleophile, will easily attack over this carbon, replace halogen to give final ether as a product. So nature of chemical reaction may also be asked on this basis. One time CS3Cl, another time CS3Cs2Cl and question may be asked find the rate. Which is faster? Whether this one is faster or this one is faster. So this is also a good nucleophile. So nature of chemical reaction will be SN2. Formation of this ether is faster as compared to formation of this ether. Because steric handles over this carbon is higher as compared to this carbon. So rate R1 is greater than R2. So important part is this. ZR can attack over this carbon, breaks this bond to form alkoxide. This may abstract proton from another medium to give alcohol as a product. So this may attack over alkyl halides to give ether as a product. Reaction with oxygen. RNGX when react with oxygen give R O O M Z X and when water is added to the system then finally R O H is obtained as a product. Mechanism of this reaction is uncertain so I am not writing the mechanism. It is important to note that when ZR is reacts with oxygen followed by water, the alcohol is obtained as a product. We only attach OS group with this R. This R may be single bonded, may be double bonded. We only attach OS group with this particular R. Now, do some question. Now try to find, this is alcohol, this is ketone and this is acid halide. Three functional groups are there, this CR may attack over this part, may attack over this part or may attack over this part. So question is on the basis of reactivity. We will observe from different chemical reaction that reactivity of ZR towards organic molecule follows a reaction of acid base that is acidic hydrogen then aldehyde then ketones then acid halide then anhydride then ester 
and then alkyl halide. So here, this is alcohol which have acidic hydrogen. This particular is ketone and this particular is acid halide. So first reaction of acid base. So this ZR will act as a base attack over this hydrogen and with it is release out. So first attack will be observed over acidic hydrogen. Now reactivity of ketone is higher as compared to acid halide. So second ZR, second ZR will attack over this position, not this position. Then now third ZR will attack over this position, replace halogen. Now if CH3 group is attached to this part, ketone will be obtained as a product. So ketone is also reactive. So another ZR, fourth ZR will attack over this part to form the alkoxide. So now from this reaction, four molecules, four molecules are zero are used for the chemical reaction. Question may be asked like this. Ester may be cyclic, ester may be acyclic. Anhydride may be cyclic, anhydride may be acyclic. Anhydride even may be three member cyclic rings also, may have three member cyclic ring also. CS3, MZ, BR. CS3 and Z Br. Now, this carbon has positive positive charge. This negative part attack over this, breaks this bond, form this type of compound. Now, another CR attack, breaks this bond to give. This compound is take proton from water and final give this type of diode. Again, this CR attack with this part, next this one. From this type of compound. Bond is broken. This is obtained. Another here. Again attack over this carbon. That's this one. Important part is this. Whether this ZR will attack over this carbon or not. It is no. Because of the resonance. A double bond B. C have negative charge. So this CR only attack with the carbonyl carbon and breaks this bond. After taking proton from the water, final product will be like this. This CR will attack over this carbon, break this bond. This is obtained. Again ZR attack over this carbon breaks this bond after taking proton this is obtained as a product There may be some question where examiner may ask about the formation of ZR on the basis of reactivity. That is, if bromine and fluorine is given and treated with magnesium and ether, then 
reactivity of RBR is higher at compared to the reactivity of CF. So, ZR will be obtained over this part, not over this part. This is the breaking of 2p 2p orbital, but this is the breaking of 2p 4p orbitals. So, this bond is V. So, Br carbon have insertion of magnesium and RMGF Br is formed. But if both position have Br and treated with magnesium ether, so we can replace, we can insert magnesium in both this carbon domain bond. So important part is this, if there is difference in halogen, we can replace, we can insert only one magnesium in between carbon halogen bond, but both halogens are same, in that case magnesium is inserted in both the carbon chlorine bond. If same carbon has two halogen and when treated with magnesium and ether no diazea is formed when at same position have two, two halogens when treated with magnesium ether then first zea will be formed over this position nucleophile will attack over this release halogen Alkene is obtained as a product. When there is halogen over 1 3 position, when treated with magnesium ether, ZR is formed act as a nucleophile, attack over this part, replace halogen, and 3 membered ring is formed. When there is Four carbon difference between two halogen. So now, in that particular case, diZr may be formed. So important part is this: for the preparation of diZr, diZr, at least four carbon must be present between two halogen then only diZr is formed but diZr is unstable it can only be formed for the chemical reaction if certain molecules or certain substrate are present like this ester is there which on reaction with CS3, Br, CS, Br, Mg, CS2, 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 Mg, Br. So first this Gr attack over this part, break this bond to give OR. 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, MZBR, again this part attack over this, release this OR and finally give this type of product. So important part is this, DICR can only be obtained when certain substrate is there in which 5 member or 6 member rings are formed but if 5 member or 6 member rings are not formed so in that case diZr will not be formed as a product because of the instability there are some questions where is treated with some terminal alkynes as this terminal alkyne 
also acidic in nature, hydrogen acidic in nature. So this CR attacks over this hydrogen, make another ZR. So this is this reaction is used for increasing the number of carbon in ZR. Here the number of carbon is 1, but here the number of carbon may be anything, depends on the carbon. Again, this CR may attack over acidic hydrogen or may attack over the partial positive center positive positive center to give further chemical reaction like if this particular is treated with this epoxide this nucleophile attack over this part may break this bond negative triple bond ah, this will be obtained which after taking proton limited amount of proton will give this alcohol as a product so GR react with terminal alkynes to form another GR which may attack over the carbon is partial positive center to form alkoxide will take which after taking proton will give alcohol as a product one another reaction may attack over sulfur this particular also a positive positive charge so this GR may attack over sulfur to break this bond this particular may also be attacks over carbon nitrogen bond this particular may also attack over sulfur, sulfur bond so important part is this, a partial positive charge is there nucleophile will attack over it to give final product 